So today I'll be showing you how to fix the problem with sound not working on your Roku TV. Okay. Now this is going to be uh, pretty straightforward. I'm going to show you a couple of things you can do and out of the solutions I'm going to show you, at least most of you should have the problem fixed. So the first thing I want us to do here is to perform a reset of the Roku TV. And for this one, you're going to use a special key combination on the Roku remote. And this is going to reset all the essential parts or the essential functions of your Roku TV, sound being one of them. Okay, so we're going to press the home button five times and then press the up button once and then the rewind button twice and the forward button twice. Okay, so you have to be very consistent with the way you press these buttons. So let's start. So we're going to do this together. So home button, one, two, three, four, five, one, one, two, one, two, like that. And then you should see the Roku kind of going crazy a bit, and then it's going to freeze, and then it should restart and fix most of the issues with your display and your sound. So let's just wait. Just press nothing on the remote right now. Just wait, and your Roku should restart. Let's just keep waiting. There you go. So the screen goes black and the Roku TV should restart. There you go. So after the restart, your sound should now be working. Now, in case it's not working, then you might want to go ahead and reset your sound settings okay and to do that from the home screen just scroll to settings select that under settings go to audio not audio just go to system select that and then go to advanced system settings select that and then you should see factory reset select that put in the code press ok and now you can now start the factory reset now keep in mind that this is going to reset everything on the roku tv okay this is going to wipe away all your data all your login information, all your Wi-Fi information. It's going to put the uh, Roku TV back to exactly where it was when you first took it out of the box. So it's a complete clean. Huh? It's a complete wipe of the data. It's a complete factory reset. So just go ahead and press OK and factory reset your uh, Roku TV. Now, once you set it up back again, then you might have the solution to your problem fixed. Thanks for watching comments and questions down below and good luck.